Hey yo, what's going on? It's been a while since I made a video, so just bear with me because I've been trying to make this video for a while now and it's been quite interesting to say the least. So, um, yeah, haven't heard from me in a while. Um, I'm stage five kidney failure, so I've been handling that really most of the time. I'm still living in the truck. Oh, that's right, y'all didn't know I had a truck. So the Oldsmobile died. Um, we put every bit of 15, 16,000 miles on it. And it said, I'm done. Have a nice day. Um, it had issues when, when we got it. We bought it for 200 bucks. It's a great car. It, it run us, you know what, off. And... So right now I'm in a park with these mosquitoes, right? And it's making me have a very difficult time trying to make this video. So just bear with me. And if you see me swiping and doing this, it's all for you. Mm -hmm. It's all for you. It's all so y'all know that I'm still alive. But I won't be long because these mosquitoes are going to come eat my ass up. So, where was I? <laughs> the Oldsmobile. <laughs> so I had Oldsmobile. And... It's on some of the other videos, 200 bucks, and um, it died, and uh, we ended up selling it for more than we bought it for, which is pretty funny, um, but it was a great car, I mean, it, it was a great car, I don't know who in their right mind would have junked that car in the first place, it was a great car, um, but the fuel pump went, and uh, it was on our final trip to Atlantic City, which is probably the last place I've been in Atlantic City. This was like three or four months ago. And also on that trip, my phone broke. So, I haven't had a phone to make these videos in three or four months now. So, I'm just getting back to it because I bought a phone like two days ago, but I've just been waiting for the weather to act right. And now, I'm getting a phone call on a phone that shouldn't be getting a phone call. <laughs> but we're going to keep on rolling because I don't care. <laughs> Just being a difficult day today. So, I know I'm a little scruffy, a little rough looking today. Which is not nothing new for me. But at the same time, I'm a little rougher than usual. It's because some things have happened and transpired in the past four months to... Um, have been interesting to say the least. Um, so, I guess by now you've noticed that I'm missing a tooth. Well, I'm not missing one, I'm, it's just chipped. Um, yeah, so I don't go to the city much on purpose. Um, there's some new drugs out that shouldn't be out, and that cause people to do things to other people and let's just say he lost and in the process of him losing I lost a tooth uh, but he was on some serious drugs um I don't know I don't know but anyway so that's what happened to my tooth it got chipped and these mosquitoes won't leave me alone and I think we should go for a walk judging from the fact that there's probably I don't know Five or six mosquitoes on each arm right now. Um, so yeah. This is going to be a long, difficult, drawn out video and stuff. So anyway. Yeah. So I got this phone two days ago. And um, I am just now figuring out how to make a video that lasts longer than 15 seconds. And so, um, I'm just getting around to making the video. Now, for the past four months or so, I've been going through stage five renal failure, which is uh, kidney failure. And um, this whole kidney situation, I mean, eventually I'm going to be on dialysis. So, lately I've been stuck in the D.C., Maryland, Virginia area. Somewhere I'm not too fond of, but I have to be here because this is where my insurance allows me to be. So I've been making the best of a bad situation, I guess. I'm still doing the traveling thing, 
just not as much as I would like to be. And um, right now we're, we're staying in a Chevy Blazer, which is okay. It's all right. It's not too bad. It's it's okay. But of all the cars I've had that I've stayed in, a Chevy Blazer is not my top pick. It is not my top pick. Not, 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 will never be my top pick. Um, I could probably fold the back seat down if we didn't have stuff in the back. And then, you know, probably lay flat. At least that was my train of thought when I bought this thing. Um, oh yeah, and by the way, I only paid 200 bucks for this. And so far, we have... It was on 43,000 when I bought it. Alright, so, so far we've put 7,000 miles on it. And it's been two weeks since I fixed it. And when I bought it, it needed a fuel spider thing in it. And so I had to take the intake apart to do that and get it running. And it sat for probably about a month before I even got around to doing that. Because before this, I had a pickup truck. And... Well, y'all have missed a few things, and there's a few things that I didn't get the chance to film that I should have, but I didn't, and I'm sure things would have been a lot more interesting if I would have. Right now, I'm just going in circles, and I'm just kind of rambling on, so I understand if you're bored with this video already, but I just wanted to say that I am still alive, and I am still kicking, and I am still here, and uh, I'm going to be making videos a lot more frequently. A lot more frequently so you can look forward to that also I would like to spend send a special shout out to Bob Wills because he put the video of me and him on there on his channel um, cheaprvliving.com okay that's a B <laughs> yeah that's a B we're getting out of here alrighty give me one second bear with me we will be getting out of my truck because there's a bee in my truck, and I don't do bees. <laughs> Hell out of here. All right. We'll just, yeah. So yeah, special shout out to him for sure. Um, if it wasn't for him, I don't know that I would be here right now. Because for a long time, many years, I didn't know that there was other people out here doing this. And I thought something was wrong with me. For liking to live in my vehicle. Um, can't stress that enough. Um, I would sit on the tailgate, but I guess it ain't gonna happen. So anyway, Jesse is still in the picture. I think she went to go use the bathroom. And uh, she's still hanging around. And um, I was gonna try to get her on video, but... I guess it's, it's not going to happen. And I just realized that I'm holding this camera the wrong way. So if the video is slightly small, then that might have something to do with it. However, that's the blazer that I picked up for 200 bucks. And it's not too bad of a blazer. Um, sorry. But I've done a lot better for 200 bucks in the past. Alright, so clearly he's gone, I hope. I'm not just lurking in here somewhere. So yeah, for 200 bucks, I've done a lot better in the past. But at the same time, a running driving vehicle that needs a muffler and has new tires on it for 200 bucks is a great deal. Especially when the four-wheel drive works. It's for sale. <laughs> it is definitely for sale. I'm selling it because it's uncomfortable. You will never be comfortable in this thing unless you fold down this back seat here, lay the seat down, and then you could probably lay flat in the back. But the problem is we got clothes, I have tools, and I don't go nowhere without my tools. I refuse to. Is the minute I set my tool somewhere, is the minute this thing is going to break down, just like the old one Bill did. So I'm not doing that no more because it's an ongoing thing. 
<clears throat> been out here long enough to know better than to leave my tools behind because when you leave your tools behind, that's when it's kind of one of them things. Like I think it's uh, I don't know if if you wash your car, it'll start raining. Well, if you leave your tools, it's gonna break down. So yeah, it, this hasn't been a good year for me buying cars at all. Not at all. Normally I get some pretty good deals, but this year has been uh, so-so. Um, but I do have an offer for a trade for a 73 Mustang. So I might go ahead and indulge in that. It's up in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, which if you know about where Harrisburg is, it's about 15 miles from Hershey, Pennsylvania. And if you don't know where Hershey, Pennsylvania is, Hershey, Pennsylvania is where the Hershey's chocolate comes from. And I would definitely be taking a video while I'm there because they have this thing called Hershey Park. Hershey Park is an amusement park in Hershey, Pennsylvania. They also have a car, antique car museum. Y'all know I like cars. And yes, yeah, so I was thinking about taking my son up there and uh, doing that because I know that he would really like to go do that. Actually, when he was a kid, my son was, I don't know, two, three months old. We took him up there. Uh, and then we took him up there again, me and my son's mother. Took him up there again when he was about three or four. And they have a train museum up there where they, they let you ride the old trains and stuff. And you can go see him, you know. And uh, my son loves trains. So I took him up there to see the trains and stuff like that, you know. I think it's about time that we go again. Now, right now, the catch is, I don't know that this thing's going to make it there. But at the same time, I don't care. Um, it's not... It's not the uh, destination. It's the adventure getting to where you're going sometime. <laughs> so, that's what the plan is, I guess. Um, today is Friday. And um, I'm supposed to be going to check this car out tomorrow. And it's a 73 Mustang. And it's got a 6 cylinder in it with a 4 speed. And it's a slot car. And I like it. So I was thinking about getting it. And um, yeah. Um, a lot has happened in four months. And there's a lot for me to cover that I'm not going to get to in this video. So. I don't know, just keep looking and eventually I'll get shaved up and I'll be pretty again and I'll make another video about some of the other crazy things that's happened in the past, I don't know, what, four months now, but I just wanted to let y'all know I'm still here, I'm still alive, still kicking, special shout out to Bob Wells because he's the man and um, yeah. Still around. So, um, it's just had to take some time off from making videos and being concerned about a phone and other things to try to stay in one piece. Because, uh, one day I'll do a video about the things that I go through. Um, because it's a lot. And you know what? As personal as it is, I think that. There's other people that think that they might be alone. Because for a long time I thought that it was just me by myself. With a lot of things. Not just, not just, you know, being on the road things. But just a lot of things. And, uh, and maybe, maybe, I mean, it might not speak to you per se. But maybe it speaks to somebody. You know what I mean? Um, it's just a thought. Just a thought, but anyway, I am going to get off of here, because I'm pretty sure I done burned her battery up. You know, I keep forgetting that I have a phone now. I'm so used to using her phone, so I'm burning my battery up. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I'm going to 
get off of here because I'm burning my battery up. And if you like the video, then like and subscribe. I mean, if you don't like the video, like and subscribe anyway, because eventually I'm going to say something that clicks. Eventually. Um, sooner or later. <laughs> sooner or later. Just right now, I'm just letting y'all know I'm still alive. Look forward to hearing from me very soon, though. I'll probably try to make a video once a week now that I have a phone. But, um, you might get two or three videos at a time because I don't have internet on my phone. So there's no Wi-Fi. So I'd have to go somewhere where there's Wi-Fi or something. And I don't know. But, uh, I'll figure it out and I got you. Just bear with me, and yeah, struggle is real. <laughs> um, yeah. So anyway, I'll talk to y'all later. Like the video if you like it, and like, don't like it, and like it anyway. Like it because you like it, and like it because you don't like it. And share it, and do all that good stuff, and uh, yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. Well, I'll talk to y'all later if I can figure out how in the heck to get this damn thing to cut off. And you know what? I try. So, I'm not tech savvy. And I go through this with every phone. Like, you know, I'll get the phone and then I'm trying to figure out how to make this thing work. And then when I figure out how to make it work, I can't figure out how to unmake it work. <laughs> so, then you end up with me rambling on trying to find the stop button. And not knowing exactly how to stop the stop button. And then you see fingers and stuff in the end of the video. I don't know what I'm doing. So, I guess I'm still here. Well, you're more than welcome to leave the video now. <laughs> you can roll out if you'd like. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out how to stop this damn thing. Alright, here we go. I think this... Tap the screen and then you do this.